Well, since Jane was told by the doctor that Mr. Race only imagines he's ill and that all he needs is to get his mind off himself, Jane has been planning to make her husband forget. Last night, she arranged a bridge game with her niece Betty and Betty's husband Carl, playing against Jane and Mr. Race. Our scene now is the following evening in the living room after dinner. We find Jane and Mr. Race alone. Jane is at the telephone. Listen. Why, sure, Betty. Come on. We're glad to have you. He does? Oh, I think Carl's so sweet. Why, sure, come on. We'll be glad to. Come right over. Goodbye, then. They're coming over to play again. Play what? Bridge, like we played last night. Oh, no, I'm not going to play any more bridge like you played last night. Oh, now, dear, don't start that. I just told her to come over. Well, you better get a fourth. We have a fourth. Carl's the fourth. Betty's the third, and I'm the first. Now we need a second, and it's you. Mm, if you play any more bridge like you did last night, you'll need a second. Jane, what do you think of when you play bridge? Or what do I think of? Yes, I'd just like to know what you think of. Oh, anything that comes to my mind. Anything that comes to you? Uh, mm. does, uh, does bridge ever come to your mind during the course of the evening? Oh, now and there. Why? What? I think of bridge sometimes while I'm playing. Oh, well, that's nice. I mean, uh, well, uh, did you think of it last night while we were playing? Well, not very often. I was more interested in you relaxing and having a good time. Hmm, I see. I <laughs> could have a good time winning once with you as my partner. Oh, well, what did we lose? A poultry dollar and 20 cents. Honestly, you sound like a tightrope. What's a dollar Look, and 20 cents? Uh, Jane, I'm not even thinking of the money. I'm thinking of the idea of playing bridge, if you're going to play bridge. Well, we're going to play tonight because Betty and Carl are on their way over. Well, I don't blame them for wanting to come over. Sure, they ought to come over to visit us. I said to Betty last night, I says, well, you don't come to visit your old aunt anymore, I said. Well, just to visit is different. Oh, I wouldn't say old. What? Where did I get that old aunt stuff? Are you starting an argument with yourself? Yeah, what did I mean by that? Uh, look. Jane, this is confusing enough as it is. I still say I don't mind if they come over the visit. But did you get the way they gloated when they won last night, especially that niece of yours? What did she do? I didn't get that. She gloated. She and Carl both. They acted too superior. And they only play a less-than-average game. I could beat them single-handed if you kept your wits about you, but you don't. You play worse now than you used to. Oh, well, I can't get excited over 57 little cards. 57 little cards. I don't see the way you and Betty and Carl carry on. Last night, the way he said to her, Is that your six, partner? Is that your three? What's a six or a three? If she had a king or an ace or... A six or a three could mean a lot in bridge. It's a signal. Signal? Sure. When you play bridge and you want your partner to continue playing a certain suit, you... Throw him a six instead of a smaller card. Or if you don't want him to, you throw him a three or a four, anything under a five. You mean to say that Betty and Carl you six? Oh, I don't believe it. Oh, you don't. All right, don't. I can't believe it, dear. Well, there's nothing wrong in it. Everybody plays that way. Oh, but you wouldn't understand it, though. I'd like to beat them just once. They, they think they're so good. They take advantage of every little thing you do. Everything I do? What do I do? Oh, everything. In the first place, you hold your card so that anybody a mile away can tell just how many you have in each suit. Then when you have no more of that suit, you close that up and move the cards around to make sure they know you have no more. What was that again? I, oh, I'm not going to go through that again. Look, Jane, I'd just like to beat them tonight just to get even after all the aggravation we had last night. Let's do something. What? We won't take any money from them after the game, but I just want to make sure we win. Oh, how can you be sure about a thing like that? We after can all? be sure. Now, look. Remember uh, remember a set of signals I taught you some time ago? Oh, about three or four years ago? I don't think so. Well, I'll teach them to you again now. They're very simple. Now, look. Suppose Betty is the dealer and she passes. Now, I'm second. I haven't got enough to bid with, but I have a fairly good hand, you see? So instead of saying, I pass... I say ditto. Ditto? Ditto. That means I have a lot of diamonds. D for ditto and D for diamonds. Oh, that's cute. You see, now, uh -huh. if Betty passes and I have a lot of spades and I want to pass, instead of passing, I say, same here. S for spades and S for same here. Yeah. And if I have hearts, I say, have to pass, 
H for heart and H for half the pad. Oh, I see. Yes, and if I say can't bid, <laughs> well, what would that mean? I don't know. They're your signals. You don't know. I just gave you hearts, spades, and diamonds. What other suit is there? No trap? No tra- No, j- club. C for can't bid and C for club. Oh, yes. It just comes out even, doesn't it? C for club. That's you, dear. I suppose it's all right to do it if they use signals like with a six or Well, three. Jane, these are a different kind of signals. I wouldn't advise using them all the time, but I just want to beat them tonight for once, anyhow, just to make take some of that conceit out of them. Will you, will you try to remember those now? Uh, well, let me see if I've got them. Yeah. If you say same here, that mm. means same. Is that right? That's right. Just the first letter of whatever I say. Oh, the first letter. I didn't get that before. You didn't get... Well, that's what the whole thing's about. You see, if I say ditto after Betty passes, for instance, that would mean diamond. D stands for ditto, and it stands for diamond. Oh, tomorrow. Tomorrow? Came the dawn. I Ch- see what you mean oh. now. I like that. If Betty passes and you say something, I have to figure out what you've got by the first letter of what you say. Yes, have to pass would mean hearts, and can't bid means clubs. And so and, so and so so. Uh, oh, I like that. Well, try to keep that in mind, will you? And let's see if we can't send them home talking to themselves once. We won't take any money if we win. We're oh, just there to... they are. Now, hush, dear. Don't say anything about the signals in front of them. Don't say. Well, I hope not. Uh, just a minute. Don't say anything about it in front of How do you like that? I'll get out the bridge table and stuff, The cards are on the desk there, dear. Yes, I see them. Well, hello. Hello, Aunt Good evening. Come in. My, you got here fast. How's Uncle A? Oh, he's fine now. He's thinking about bridge all the time. He never thinks of himself anymore. Well, good evening, Uncle well, A. Yeah, hi, Carl. Yeah, we ought to get some more of that easy money. Yeah, well, we'll see about that as soon as I get this stuff set up here. Oh, here, I'll lend your hand. Thanks. Will you, Carl? You just get those chairs out of there. You sure like to play, don't you, Betty? Do I? No, I asked you that. I <laughs> certainly do. I could play bridge every night. Here we are. You uh, where are those cards, James? On the desk there. Oh, yes, I see. Well, yeah. Here we go. All set. Let's get started. Come on, Betty. Let's take these two over. Oh, now, wait a minute. Don't be too sure about that. You not only held every ace and king in the deck last night, but you had a cinch playing me single-handed. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't yeah. say that. Don't argue with them, Betty. That's always the cry of the loser. How about it? You want to raise the stakes tonight? How about a tenth of a cent instead of a twenty? Well, that suits me. How about you, Aunt Jane? Oh, wait a minute. Don't sit there, Betty. You have to sit here. Well, what difference does it make? Well, you have to sit here, Betty, and then after you pass, your uncle can uh, say... Look, uh, Jane, it doesn't matter whether... Yes, it... it does, dear, because Betty has to pass first in order for uh, you to... What does she mean? Uh, I don't know. She's a little confused. All right, Betty, then you sit here, and I'll sit after you. If she wants it that way, we'll let her have it her way. Huh? Well, all right, but I don't see what difference it makes. None here. at all. How it's... about it? Aunt Jane, a tenth of a cent all right for you? Oh, yes. I play just the same if I'm playing for fun or for money. Yes, we know, Jane. Okay, Betty, suppose you start the deal. All right, I'll deal the blues. Fine. I'll shuffle this deck. You want to keep score, Uncle Ace? No, 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 not me. How about you, Aunt Jane? Oh, yes, I play just the same if I'm <laughs> playing for fun or for money. <laughs> no, no, I mean, do you want to keep the score? No, you'd better keep the score, Carl. She has enough to do. Yes, and... I've got enough to think about, haven't I, dear? Mm-hmm, yes. Uh, then it's uh, for a tenth of a cent, is that right? Take it easy on yourself. Oh, by the way, I never did find out just what system you two play. Well, suppose we don't bother about systems. Well, we'd like to know what your no-trump bid is. Well, uh, our no-trump bid varies. Jane plays a loud no-trump if she has a good hand, well, and the soft no-trump denial. <laughs> oh, good. Well, then there's a questionable no-trump. You know, when one partner bids and the other partner isn't quite sure what to respond with, he usually says, one no-trump? You know, up there like that. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, I've heard right that there. often enough. No, but seriously, what do you play? Well, we don't play seriously. That's our trouble. But we'll do the best we can. We'll, uh, we'll just call it a strong no trump if that'll make you happy. Okay, that's what we play, too. All right, that's good enough for me. We play the strong no trump, Aunt Jane. All right. All right, Jane. Now you can pick up your hand. The cards are all dealt. Oh, Oh, yes. Now, just a minute. Don't rush me. Oh, we won't, Aunt Jane. You just tell us when you're ready. Well, let's not play too fast tonight. It's very early. That's right, Jane. Just keep your wits about you. I am, dear. Don't worry. Mm-hmm. Ready? I'm first. Uh, go ahead, Betty. It's your bid. I pass. Uh, ditto. Mm, same here. Um, uh, what was that? What? 
Now, just a minute. Which one of you said ditto, and which one uh, said same here? Jane, will you please just go on? Well, now, oh, wait a minute, dear. I was busy looking at my cards, and I didn't watch who said what. Well, what do you mean, Aunt Jane? Oh. Well, which did you say, Carl? Ditto or same here? Well, what difference does that make? Ditto or same here? I passed. Doesn't matter what I say. Oh, yes, it does. Uh, Jane, would you mind just going on with the bidding? Let's not start anything. I don't understand what the argument's about. It, it's nothing, Betty. She just doesn't understand. Uh, oh, what did you say, dear? No, uh, uh, look, Aunt Jane, this isn't according to Hoyle, you know. Uh, Carl, don't start throwing Hoyle on troubled waters, will you? Jane, just forget the whole thing. You mean forget all of us? Yes, the... Jane, just forget. I don't understand what the argument's about. It's no argument, Betty. Now, look, you... Betty passed, Uncle Ace passed, and I passed. Now, it's up to you, Aunt Jane. Yes, I know he passed, but one of you said ditto, and one said same here. It doesn't make any difference. Now, you bid. Well, if you won't tell me, I bid a spade. Mm. I double. I bid two diamonds. I double. Uh, same here. What? what did you say, Aunt Jane? What do you do? I said same uh, here. Jane, do you pass? Oh, I don't know what I do. Uh, dear, can I see you in the kitchen a minute? In the kitchen? What's going oh, on here? Oh, is it that? <laughs> it, it doesn't look as if Mr. Ace is going to fare very well tonight, even with the signals. But we learn more about our friends when next we meet the Easy Aces. 